Good morning everyone, I hope you're doing well. As you can tell, I'm looking very sweaty. I've just got back in for a run. It wasn't even that long or that far, but I haven't run for the last like two, three weeks. Basically, the last time I ran was back home. I haven't run since being at uni and I really wanted to get out for a run. So that's what I thought I would do because there's also a park quite close by. So I ran over to there, then ran through the park a little bit and then came back. Um, but yeah, that was definitely tough. I just did a 4K, I think. Normally I'd do at least a 5, but today that just wasn't going to happen. But it was nice to get out, and at least the air's nice and fresh. When I first out, I was like, oh my god, it's so cold. But I appreciated it once I actually started running. And now I look like a bright red, sweaty cherry tomato. But it is another really lovely day. I opened up the curtains this morning. I was like, oh, it's so sunny and nice. I just want to get out there, go for a run, go for a little explore. Because, like I said, I've never been running around here before, so that'd be nice also i hope you're having a lovely sunday as you're watching this let me know what you're up to if you're doing anything have a nice chill sunday um and yeah i'm about to go make myself some breakfast now i'm thinking pancakes today it's the weekend i'm feeling like pancakes after a long run or not a long run after a short run um I'm gonna have some pancakes, I think, is what I'm gonna do. And then, what else am I gonna do today? I've got some editing and reading for my lectures to do this morning, but then this afternoon I'm meeting up with three of the girls from uni, um, and we're gonna head into Brighton, head down near the beach, and then also we'll go do our food shopping for the week, so we were all like, oh, actually it's useful, we're going into town, so we all need to go and get some food. So, that is the plan for today. It's also an open day on campus right now, and I was running back looking like this, and there's just loads of people walking around, and I was like, mm, this is great but oh well it feels good to have got out first thing in the morning i love getting out first thing in the morning there's a noisy bus going past so i've had to open up the window to let some cool air into my room because right now i'm just like boiling hot how good do these look i can't wait to dig in i've got my little pancake stack and then i've got some frozen berries i've melted some koyo coconut yogurt on top and then a drizzle of maple syrup as well oh, it looks so tasty it's a fair few hours later now i think last thing i showed you my breakfast i can't remember but it's actually caught past two now so i'm going to be heading out soon down into brighton i basically spent a couple of hours this morning trying to get through reading i still haven't made it through the first one it literally took me like a good two hours to get to where i am i'm getting there with it i haven't got too actually i'm looking at it. there's a lot of it left too much of it left but um yes yeah, so i've still got quite a bit of reading left to do but i'll probably carry on with some of that later and then i also did like half an hour or so of editing as well because i needed a reading break and i've just recently had my lunch and then got myself fully ready to go out so i'm about to head down now and hopefully it should be a really nice afternoon out exploring brighton <laughs> How are there people actually in the sea? That is insane. <laughs> I can't, I can't believe. believe. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I feel like this is okay, going to go so wrong. Good, you need to go more that way. I did I do need to go off my house. Just saying no. You need to wash it. I'm going to get your head up. I think this is such an unblessed again. <laughs> <laughs> I've just recently made it back in from Brighton. It's currently half seven. I'm about to go get some dinner because I am starving right now. Um, but yeah, we also did like stopped after a food shop as well at Sainsbury's on the way back, and then we finally made it back. We thought that the bus wasn't going to stop anywhere near the uni though because there's um, Boundary Festival going on in Stanmer Park, which is right next to where the uni is, and so the road. Is like leading up to the uni is cut off at the moment luckily it stopped literally like right close by though so that was very lucky so i mean it's a little bit further than we would have had to walk but literally only like two three minutes longer than it would have been so that could have been a lot worse than it was but i desperately need to go get some dinner and then it's x factor i don't know if i'm going to get around to carrying on with editing or reading tonight because i'm just so tired as well but I need some food first and then I'll see how I'm feeling. So I just finished having my dinner. I just made like a quick stir fry kind of thing. Um, Cause I was so hungry and just wanted a quick dinner. I'm about to get watching X Factor. It starts in like five minutes, I think. And it's also the six chair challenge tonight, which is where it starts to get interesting. I think always at that point, you start to get to know the contestants a bit more, 
six chair challenge it's always a bit dramatic drama always kicks off so i've got my pajamas on I'm about to go wash off my makeup make myself a cup of tea to go along with that and hopefully it will be good but i just thought i would end this vlog quickly here i don't know how much footage i got today or not but i don't know anyway i hope you enjoyed it all the same also just thought as you're watching this new main channel video went up an hour ago it's this month's favorites of course it's the last sunday of september as i do every month so be sure to head over to my main channel check that out the video will be linked down below in the description as my previous video as well as my main channel is linked down there too we are like i mean we're on 910 subscribers or something we're like slowly on the road up to 1k so if you haven't subscribed over there be sure to do that also if you haven't subscribed here feel free to do that too we're getting close to 100 on this one so that'll be cool if we can reach that and yeah smash a big thumbs up on this vlog if you've enjoyed it and i'll be sure to see you very soon with a brand new vlog night